the widow and mother of five, tells us she has questions about her husband's final moments on Monday at the Colonial Plaza in Orlando. That's where News 6's Eric Sandoval joins us live tonight. And Eric, you spoke with her from Texas. Is that where she lives? It is. As she and her five children live in Texas, uh, Lisa. She says one silver. Her husband actually came here to Orlando to work in the construction business. He was making money here, sending it back there. She told us she has no idea why he was in Colonial Plaza here on Monday, let alone with two women and another man before he died. I have so many questions because I'm never going to see my husband again. Speaking to us on Facebook with her children tonight, Vera Deanna Silva went over this video that we first aired on Monday on News 6 and ClickOrlando.com. It shows Orlando police talking to the driver of a minivan with their guns drawn. The driver later identified as Silva's husband, 32-year-old Juan Alberto Silva. Police say two suspected shoplifters had just crawled inside that minivan. These ladies were accused of shoplifting. Would him hanging out with women who were accused of something like that be out of character for him? Yes. Yes. Because so over here, he wouldn't go out with women. Like, she would be home from work. The video then shows the driver taking off and police opening fire. You saw the video where he, he takes off and he almost clips a police officer. Do you know why he would possibly do that? I don't know what crossed his mind, but... It seems like he panicked. He was running for his life. Orlando Police Chief John Mina says it was his officers that were in fear for their lives. As Silva figures out how to bring her husband's body back to Texas tonight, she says she has one big question for Orlando Police. Why they shoot him so many times? It was like more than, it was like five, six times. I mean, I think one, it was enough. That question and whether the officers acted appropriately for this case are now the target of a Florida Department of Law Enforcement investigation. Because that investigation is going on right now, Orlando police are not commenting any farther. Silva, meantime, says she's going to be asking her relatives to help raise the couple's five children. We're in Orlando tonight. Eric Sandoval, News 6.